Welcome back to and this guides. In today's video, we are going to show you how to disable ad block on Firefox. Let's begin. Now, the first thing you need to do is to download Firefox. And by following the on-screen instructions, you're good to go. Many websites rely on ad revenue to support their operations and disabling ad block helps ensure these sites can continue to offer free content. For example, I'm now on Firefox and you wanted to get your ad block for the first time. Now these are the options that you can put the extension on Chrome and a lot of different browsers. But for now, I'm using Firefox. When I click on the get ad block, now all I'm going to do is click the ad to firefox all right but the thing is some websites block access to their content if they detect an ad blocker all right so practically disabling ad block allows you to access the full content of the sites as you can see i have the option right now um, all i'm gonna do is click on ad all right of course but for now we're not gonna do this we're just going to get the uh, extension as you can see, the extension has been added here. When you click the puzzle icon on the upper right corner, I want you to click on it. Okay. Click on that. Now, for you to be able to disable ad block on Firefox, all you're going to do is just click again the uh, puzzle icon and click on the manage extensions. As you can see, all you're going to do is from here, you have two options. You want to slide it off. To turn it off to disable that's one way and you also have the three ellipses buttons here click on remove and again you also wanted to click on manage if you wanted more customization upon the uh, performance of your ad block and as you can see there's the details and permissions but i don't want you to necessarily just remove ad block because it's a very helpful tool for the uh, spammy websites at least you have a, a full security measures when you enter a unfamiliar websites for that matter but the thing is again if you think the uh, website is safe all you're gonna do if you're using firefox just go to the settings right here in the puzzle icon slide it off or click the ellipsis icon to remove that all right and I believe that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you again in the next one.